I think uh, that Russia has already earned a place among terrorists. And this no longer depends on their leadership. No, I think their leaders are no longer affecting the development of Russian Federation, its culture and so on. Everything depends on the strength of Ukraine, its support by the partners, the political support from the world, as well as from the Russian society. They have to open their eyes if they want to see the future of the Russian Federation with their eyes. They have, will have to recognize their own mistakes, they will have to recognize the UN statutes, and they will have to really respect our territorial integrity. I'm really glad to hear that Mr. Kissinger changed his mind. Our priority today, our political task today, is to see that different political leaders and figures, those who are still very relevant or have been relevant until recently, for them to be able to recognize the great mistake that Putin committed, for them to recognize this is Russia's aggression. These moments, it is very important for them as well to politically pressure on Russia to stop this bloody aggression. As regards NATO, we clearly understand that security guarantees are among the top priorities for us. Speaking of our formula for peace, it is among the ten priorities. We don't understand that at the moment we are not in NATO yet. Yeah, unfortunately, Russia does understand this as well, and they do their damnedest to not make it easier for us to join. But we are on the way towards NATO because NATO is the best security guarantee for us, for our country, for our kids, for our country. So we have suggested security guarantees for our nation and we think that the civilized world is going to support